Hi everybody and welcome back to my channel. Um, I have a Scrap Diva Designs, a design team project to share with you guys. So I got this cute little golf cart, which I showed you in a previous video. So I wanted to show you guys what I created with this. And uh, let's start off with the paper pad that I used. Um, I found this um, homemade paper. Um, I think Cartabella is Echo Park or Simple Stories. I don't know which one it is, but whoever makes this uh, line of paper, which I, I feel like it's Echo Park, but um, I bought, they always have warehouse sales and I always go back and I find like really super pretty paper pads and they're usually like if you buy like five or they have something like you buy x amount and you get it for a certain price so they come out to be really inexpensive um to buy them this way and even though they're older collections i don't care as long as it's cute um so i wanted to go with this like farmhouse theme one today so that's that um and then let me show you guys the project so I decided to make this cute little mini book. Now see, my thoughts in my head was, it could go for a little tractor. <laughs> but it is actually a golf cart. But I was like, why not? Let's give it a try. So I kind of put a little country spin on it. Um, so I bought this pre-done up um, mini uh, book from a Frank Garcia store. Um, as well as this little window piece. I think I got it from, no, I think I got it from Simon Says because uh, Frank's store was out of them at the time. Um, but that's where I got this beautiful little shutter piece from. So let me kind of show you guys what I did. We'll start on the back. So I layered some of that really pretty paper on the back, which I love this like pale pink with these flowers. And then I um, put this little sticker on there that says, bless this mess. I love that. Love that. And then here's the front. I didn't do anything to the window because it's all, it already has like a really pretty distressed look. And I wanted to give it like farmhouse vibes. Um, the way I've done this, I can't really shut the, close the shutters anymore. But they, they do open and close. But um, I put this little banner there. But that's okay because I'm going to display it on my shelf anyways. Um, and then here's where you have that cute little golf cart in the center. And I put a little chicken on there. <laughs> I fussy cut out that little chicken and added that in. Um, and then I just uh, created this. I did put a bit of um, foam tape under like right here and right here. Um, so to give it, pop it up a little bit. And then those little pieces that you see right here, these chipboards, they came with the collection. So I just added my own little uh, twine and added that on there and then this has fresh baked pies and then home sweet home over there and um I got these flowers from the happy crafter shop just recently so I thought I'd put on a couple of the flowers and then I added this one also the life is sweet but I am loving this it looks cute I mean it could go for a golf cart it could go for um like I said I'm gonna call it a tractor <laughs> But if you want to purchase it, it's called the golf cart if you're looking for it in her store. <laughs> but so cute. I, I just wanted to do something a little different. So most of the pages are blank because I'm going to add pictures to it. But this is what I did on the first page. Um, I just die cut this out uh, as well as this um, hugs and kisses. This is this this paper line gives me like a family feel. So I thought I'd do that. Um, this is one of the, a couple of the chipboards that I've uh, layered on there uh, at the bottom. And this side's blank, so we can definitely put a picture there. And then this side, I left room for a picture, and I just put favorite family memories, so I can put a picture below that. I made this cute little um, rosette with some of the paper. And this is another one of the... Um, the really pretty um, chipboards and it just says home sweet home. I just like the sentiments that go with this. It's so cute and very family. And then uh, here's the other side, which a picture can go back there. Um, I added this cute little um, envelope using the strawberry paper. And then I added a cute little bow on there. It does, uh, it is Velcroed, um, so I can put something inside of there. I haven't yet. But um, it definitely, um, you could put some additional photos in there. 
um, since there's only so many pages that you can uh, put photos on. And then this one right here, I love this one. I I didn't want to, I don't want to put anything over that because I like that happy, uh, happiness is homemade. And then this one as well, this cute little like package of sunflowers. And these are just cut aparts from the paper. So I love that. And then I added that cute little uh, chipboard chicken there or rooster, I should say. So fun. And then over here, we can do a cute picture. I love that flower paper as well. And then this is a, a bow that I've added and I put a little strawberry pie and the paper already said, let's eat. So I thought that was cute. It has like food and um, cooking utensils on, on that page. And then here's another page, family is forever. You can definitely get a picture there. And then I just added this right here with some more of the pies. And this is one of the um, stickers from the sticker sheet. Um, that always come with a cartabella and then um, two more spaces for some pictures and then we're back to the back so I thought that was really fun and I wanted to put a, again a little twist on um, adding the um, the little golf cart in there so so super fun so uh, again you can uh, check out my description box um, for more details and if you guys have any questions you can go ahead and uh, leave it in the comment section and I'll be happy to answer. And you guys have a great day and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.